Oh, his eyes are so dreamy. I am in love. He is magnificent. What wonderful style! How attractive! That is a good look for you. Hmm. What a saucy fellow you are! You are making my knees tremble. You are as beautiful as an oasis in a parched desert waste. You are very entertaining. Ah, yes. Let's see it. Excellent. Give us a little show. I am honored to have met you. What a splendid fellow you are! Unsurpassed by any other. I do not know the words to express how wonderful you are. Oh my, you naughty thing! So romantic. Ah!、Oh, you are making me sweat. You have me spellbound. How could I resist you? You are irresistible. Oh my! Do you know what you do to my heart? You are very romantic, aren't you? Oh my! <laughs> ah yes, show me, my love. What are you going to do now? I cannot wait. Yes. Always a delight to see your beautiful face. Hello. So good to see you again. You are back. I cannot believe it. I am blushing just at the sight of you. Ah, yes, my sweet. I love to hold your hand. You are a close friend. But perhaps you would like to be even closer. A date with you would be lovely. What do you say? Wonderful. Lead the way, darling. Please, take my hand. Right here. It's perfect. I enjoyed our time together. Thank you. You have stolen my heart. You make me burn with love. That is so romantic, and here of all places, perfect. I could fall in love in a place like this. I'm yours forever now, my darling. Ooh, I like this house. Now that is a really nice place. Not a bad home. Not a great one either, to be honest. That is, not a very nice house. I could never live there. So, where are we going? I love holding your hand, my love. Reminds me of when we first met. So, here we are. You're just so funny, dear. <laughs> I always have fun when you are around. Oh, darling, I love you so much. I just feel better when you are near, darling. You are the perfect husband for me. Why don't you wear that outfit any more? You know, the one with the.、Uh, you know, you are rather busy, aren't you? I wish you could spend a little more time with me. Oh, darling, you look hot. You are looking particularly good today, my sweet. Darling, I have something for you. I hope you like it. I want to give you a little something, my love. I know we haven't been married long, but already, I can hardly remember what life was like without you. Remember what it was like when we were first married. We've done well together, haven't we? My mother didn't think it could last, but she was wrong, wasn't she? Just think of how long we have been married. You are really witty. You know just what I like. Thank you, my dear. You are really good at that, aren't you? Most amusing, my love. Son, 
Daddy is here, so try to be good for once. Go tell Daddy about your day. Now, now, my little darling, be a good girl. Look, dear, it's Daddy. Stay nearby, son. Son, let's go on an adventure. It's a fetch quest. We need to bring something home for supper. Sweetie, go scrub your hands. They look like they haven't been washed in weeks. Now be polite. We do not want to have that talk again. There's my clever girl. Have you had a good day? What have you been up to today, son? Ah, look how happy our little man is. He's having a good day, isn't he? No fits, no panic. Now what is he so upset about? Poor little man. I'm so thankful we adopted. Life just wouldn't be the same without her. Our little girl does miss you when you are away. But she keeps in good spirits. And she's always so happy when you return. Our girl is doing well. But I think she needs a bit more attention. Our girl has been so sad lately. Maybe she needs a change of scenery. I've heard that can help. It is amazing how strong children's spirits are. Not long ago, our son was living in the orphanage, and yet he can still laugh just as hard as any other little boy. Our son is healthy and happy. We must be doing something, right? The boy is well enough. But I wonder whether you should be spending more time with him. I am worried about our son. He's very unhappy. What should we do? Hey there, little girl. <laughs> now that's a big smile. Oh, are you having a bad day? My little man, you're so happy, aren't you? Ooh, what's wrong, little boy? Our little girl is such a happy baby. How's our little girl? Would you check on her? Poor baby girl has been a bit grumpy lately. Maybe she misses you. I hear that in Albion all they ever eat is potatoes. Potatoes baked, fried, and boiled. How odd. Mmm, the spice really wakes you up, doesn't it? Mmm, the fried locusts are really crunchy today. This tastes different today. A new recipe? Are these eggs meant to be blue, dear? Oh, no. We're not eating desert rat again, are we? You will bring me a present? How marvelous. My favorite thing. Thank you. A present from you would be most welcome. It is good what you have done. Very good. Our home is a bit stale. It is time we moved, or at least redecorated. I need you to do something for me, my love. Do me a favor. Prove to me that you are not completely uncivilized. My friend, I need your help. Perhaps I was wrong about you. If you want to convince me, you should help me. I am grateful. You are not the monster I thought you were. Still, I don't think I can trust you. You are a dear friend. One of the closest I've ever had. I was wrong about you. You were not so bad after all. Thank you, friend. I knew I could count on you. Thank you for always being there for me. You do make me laugh. Tell us a joke. I can tell that you are a good person. Your heart is full of good intentions. I can tell. Good to see you as always, friend. You have a good reputation around here, you know. We should make you an honorary Auroran. Everyone thinks you are very witty, you know. Ah, you are back. Make us laugh again. <laughs> Good to see you.
to see you back. Sir. Hello. It's the Merry Monarch. Hello, my love. My darling. You are back. Hello, your highness. You look well today. <laughs> Most pleasant. I love it. Admirable. Most admirable. Oh, yes. I feel a bit calmer. Thank you. What a wonderful day. Thank you. That makes me feel a bit better. Oh, yes. That is good, I suppose. This place is like an oasis to me. And you just made it better. That was wonderful. Perhaps I misjudged you. I really didn't like you. But now, I am not so sure. That's it. Make me laugh. Ah, yes. Come on, then. Yes, yes. Do something funny. What a hilarious look. You must be a master of magic. You are a strong one, aren't you? My. You must eat well. What an amusing beast that dog is. That dog performs some most amusing tricks. I don't normally like dogs, but that one seems like a good little fellow. Oh no, look at that poor dog. Somebody, do something. <laughs> what a friendly dog. Ooh, dog breath. Hmm. Dogs are rather hairy, aren't they? Dog, are you hot in that fur coat? Dog, I want you to be a good boy and obey your master. Your dog is a handsome creature. My dear, you look so lovely and, um, kind today. Darling, you look different today. Honestly, I do not find that look attractive. That look is a bit odd, my dear. I should never have married you. I cannot believe how poorly you treat me. How... how are you feeling, dear? You led me to believe you were a good man. Did you deceive me? I knew it was too much to expect that you would do the right thing all the time. Please stop that, my love. I really don't like it. Are you trying to scare me to death? Is that it? Please stop, my love. I'm your husband. Must you behave like that in front of me? I cannot live like this any more. I am leaving you and I am taking our child with me. This marriage is empty. It's over. We don't have enough money to buy food or basic household needs. We cannot live like this. I have enough money to get by, my love. Thank you. Oh, darling, you spoil us, you know. I really appreciate it. There isn't enough money to run the house. I need more as soon as possible. My love, you take good care of us. Where we live is horrible. We need to move as soon as we can. Our place is nice, my love. You have good taste. I love our house. It's one of my favorite places in the world. Where we live is good enough. It's nothing special, but it is ours. The house needs some work. I had better take care of it. I am very pleased with what you have done with the house. It looks like a palace. Thank you for making our home such a lovely place, my darling. Our home is a mess. Could you do some redecorating? I quite like the decor at home, but then again it could be better. I'm unhappy with our home, dear. Perhaps we should start looking for a new place. I find myself thinking about divorce more and more. You would flirt with someone else right in front of me? Have you no respect for me? 
Get your hands off him. He's mine. What? But I am your husband already, you, you barbarian. Have you no respect for me? Behaving like that? You philandering scab! That's my husband! How can he be married to you too? Unless... Oh, how could you do this? Perhaps the time has come when we should consider a divorce. Hmm. The standards of beauty must be different where you come from. I do not understand why you have chosen to dress yourself like that. What amazing clothes! You could almost pass as a Roran if you weren't so... so... you know. You barbarians may wander around naked, but we do not behave like that here. Hmm. Do those scars still hurt? You have some nerve coming here. You will never be one of us. Why did we ever trust you? Why don't you stop? Or go home? Or anywhere far away? How unpleasant. If you were to go away, I would feel better. Ah, it is you. Again. How long are you planning to stay, this time? Oh my, it is the King of Albion. Your Highness, I hope you are in a good mood today. Oh my, Your Majesty, that is an interesting style. Hello, Your Highness. You look different today. Oh, uh, hello. Whatever uncivilized behavior you're planning, I do not want to see it. No, just keep it to yourself. Please, be kind. I'm scared to look. Are you expressing yourself again? Must you be so rude? I don't understand why you would do that. Please, stop. No, please. What vile behavior. Barbarian. Pa! We do not do that sort of thing in Aurora. We're a civilized folk. I would have never believed that someone could be so strange looking if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. If ugliness were a virtue, then you would be a saint. Do you... Choose to look like that. Stop that. Immediately. I am not that kind of person. I have no interest in that. You're not as good looking as you were. What happened? I'm not standing for this anymore. You have to die. Your crimes will not go unpunished. I do not understand why you kept that creature around. And that dog. There is something wrong about that dog. That beast is more wolf than dog. That is the scariest hound I have ever seen. You are corrupt beyond redemption. I knew I felt an evil presence. Please just... Just let me walk by... Pay, pay, pay no attention to me, Your Majesty. I, uh, um, I... What is this? A body. What has happened here? Ah, uh, someone has been killed. So, why have you come to Aurora? People from Aurora are called Aurorans. But what do you call people from Albion? As the great hero of Albion, is it hard to travel without drawing too much attention? Would you say you were a professional in your field? Does it work like that? I am coming. Just don't hurt me. 
At the temple, they say that this world is merely an illusion. But it feels real, doesn't it? They say the gods gave us the gift of speech. But why then do we use it so poorly? I think it is time I bought new sandals. I have always wanted to travel the world, but I would rather go by carriage than by foot. Are dogs common where you grew up? I had never seen one before you came. I will not go anywhere with you. Find some other fool. Enough of this. I must get back now. Goodbye. Ow! Let go of my hand. Leave me alone. Let me go. Where are you dragging me off to? Help! Why have you dragged me here? I shall follow wherever you lead. Great one. You have many followers, and I count myself as one. You are our best hope, Your Majesty. That's why I am proud to follow you. We are like grains of sand compared to you. You are like a god that walks among us. Oh, no. So very troubling. Stars above. That is a good-looking monarch. Watch out. Evil rules his heart. He is the most frightening of all. The king of Albion is a most merry fellow. He is a wise and good ruler. That much is clear. I hate him, even if he is the king. A most likable fellow, even if he is a king. Who knows what he is like? He is not an Auroran, that much I know. I wonder, is that what the people of Albion find beautiful? I heard that in Albion there is a place where white sand covers the ground, but it is cold to the touch. Sounds strange. I worry for our ancient culture. What does the future hold? My sister. The shadows took her not far from here. Ah, I cannot think about that now. Do you think it is safe here now? I fear not. At least those outsiders spend their money here. If you water your dreams with fear and worry, only choking weeds will grow. The arrogant will not find respect, nor will the violent find peace. Those that lie down with dogs get up with fleas. I'd rather talk about something else, if you don't mind. I must go, my friend. Goodbye. So nice to run into you again. Bah! That angers me greatly. Am I missing something? What does it mean? <laughs> How funny. Hmm. What a mystery. Oh, no. That's awful. Sad tidings indeed. That fills me with fear. You do realize that attempted murder is against the law. Not even rulers are above the law. I can't believe you tried to murder someone. Don't you know right from wrong? How can you come to our land and murder our people? What is wrong with you? You murderer. Why would you do that? After all we have suffered already, are you no better than this? Murder isn't right, no matter who you are. They still have not found the murderer. I think it must be an outsider. No, a Roran would do that. Why would you steal from us? You have so much already. It may not mean anything to you, but we care about our property here. You have no right to destroy it. My thumbs, look at them. They're so fat. We may have lost everything. But they cannot take our drink from us. I like to think that... What do I like to think? I've forgotten.
If you don't pass out from the heat, you will from the drink. Got to get to work. One more drink first, though. She hates me. Really hates me, just because I spend so much time here. Ah, what does she know? Is your baby girl keeping you awake at night? How is your boy? Well, I hope. Your daughter said she would have my head chopped off. That couldn't actually happen, could it? Your son is a very bad boy. Now, where could he have learned that? I saw your daughter running through the streets the other day, so full of life. How old is your son now? He seems to be growing up so fast. Such a nice boy, your son. Must be because of his father. Does your husband get annoyed with you, leaving home all the time? I saw your wife at the market the other day. She had quite an armful. It is sad that your marriage has ended, but remember, there are many more grains of sand in the desert. I hear you are married now. How are you handling the responsibility? So, a new child in the family. Do you think you want another? Welcome, Your Majesty. A new alliance and a new start. Let's hope things continue to improve. Perhaps one of the outsiders could help us. Is it customary in Albion for the rulers to hoard their wealth? In Aurora, you are expected to give what you do not need to others less fortunate. You are rather poor for someone in your station. Have you been giving your wealth to others, or spending it all on yourself? I thought the ruler of Albion would take the wealth of the people, but perhaps you are not so greedy. I want to become a storyteller and singer of songs. Does anyone know where I should go? It is a dreadful place, full of dark dreams. I was going there on business, but it fell apart. The business, I mean. Is this all my life is going to be? I could use a breath of fresh air. They treat us like dirt, and then they wonder why we are so angry. Sometimes I hate this place. Today is a happy day. Things are improving around here. I just feel like smiling. It has been so long since I felt that way. I am having such a good day. I cannot stop thinking about the attacks, the screams. Everything is stained with shadows here. My heart aches with sadness. Not good right now. Not good at all. Something is wrong here. I can feel it. I have a very bad feeling about today. The shadows. They are going to return. I am frightened. We must go somewhere safe. We carry goods from exotic lands, from the distant city of Bowerstone to the mountains of Mispeak. We have always been pawnbrokers. My father's 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 father was a pawnbroker, and so on. You see many interesting things as a pawnbroker. Many interesting stories behind these items. Who wants to fight? Are you looking at me? Are you? Drink up. It's better than sunburn. I like to think that. What do I like to think? I've forgotten. If only these drinks were free. Excuse me. There is something at the bottom of my drink. Oh, never mind. It's just sand. I can still hear their screams, no matter how much I drink. It will never be the same here, never again. Did you, did you see something dark outside? I don't want to walk out here alone. 
They might be out there again. Take shelter, whoever you may be. What if it comes back tonight? How many of us will still be alive by dawn? We are just being used by the outsiders. What profit is there in these mines for us? Nothing. A tyrant sits on the throne of Albion. And now we are her subjects. A tyrant sits on the throne of Albion. And now we are his subjects. Kaelin is a good leader. It is thanks to her that we still live and prosper. At last we can look forward to a new beginning. And it is thanks to the good and honest King of Albion. The King is truly generous, helping us rebuild our land. The people of Albion should be proud. We suffered at the crawler's hands for too long. I cannot imagine its return. It would be too much. I never believed we would be rid of the darkness forever. You are a true hero. The talking stoneface says it wants to see someone innocent. What could that mean? Did you hear? Albion will help us rebuild. We must prove to them that we are deserving of their generosity. Albion is forcing our people to work in the mines for their benefit. It is an outrage. I heard that Kaelin is going to ask the court of Albion for their help in rebuilding Aurora. With the new desert outpost, we may be able to evacuate our city in time, should another attack happen. Was it so unreasonable to ask for a desert outpost? It would have been beneficial to all. It has been a hard life, but I would not want to live anywhere but here. We must be careful here. We should move quickly. Tax, tax, tax. Is that all you know? Aurora has such a sale happening right now. Stocks are very low in Aurora, so bear that in mind. We are running low on goods here, I'm afraid. Money is coming in regularly now. Things are really looking up. It is an ill wind that blows through our town. We need more money. The market is doing well. It was better in the past, but still, things could be worse. Such a bountiful time this is. It is as if the streets were paved with gold. What will become of us? We have nothing left. Those foreigners know the cost of everything and the value of nothing. I wonder whether the owner of this shop has made some kind of mistake. Prices are so low. These prices are fair and reasonable. Is there some kind of catch? These prices are exorbitant. It is pure exploitation. This place has a certain quality about it that I really like. I do not want a drink right now, but please, don't let me stop you. What are we doing at a shop? Want to buy something, do you? I do not like it here. It feels wrong. This is an ugly place. I do not like it. This is a factory, is it? They are ugly things. You are such a great person, you know. Whoever you are. The world can't be round, I tell you. If it was, we would all fall off, wouldn't we? You, you are the one I don't like, aren't you? Pah to you, I say. If you need a bid, and who doesn't, I'm the man to see. Whether you're looking for high fashion or sensible work clothes, look no further. I have the best goods for sale in all Aurora. No, in all the world. Come, buy my goods. 
How can we rebuild Aurora without a thriving economy? Shop here and you're liable to rub elbows with celebrities. Like the one who owns the place. You can never have too much jewelry. Express your virility with a moustache. Dark times are upon us. Why not arm yourself to greet them? Any one of these is ideal for home defense. Whether you favor sword, hammer, or axe, I have what you want. Fighting from a safe distance is not cowardly. It is sensible. I must do something different with my hair. What I have is not working. I believe a tattoo should be representative of one's personality. I love the Auroran styling on your weapon. I can see you have good taste. Be careful. You could kill someone with that. Hmm. What have we here? Sometimes I feel like I can still hear your voice. I'm as parched as the desert, and I need a drink. A crocodile cocktail, and make it snappy. Let us drink the sweet fruit of the vine. If I give you a present, will you promise not to hurt me? Here, take this. I, I hope it makes you happy. I bought you a present, because you are such a good friend. I've heard you can be bribed with gifts to go away. Here, take this. Darling, I know you have just about everything, but I couldn't resist getting this for you. I missed you so much, I bought you a little gift. I can't believe it. The ruler of Albion is nothing but a common criminal. Criminal behavior. It's just not right for the ruler of Albion to stoop so low. That's not very nice, your majesty. Please, no, don't do that. You are not very popular with the people, my dear. Maybe you should do something about it. You are not welcome in these parts, your majesty. How can we trust you to rule over us when you are so obviously full of darkness yourself? Your Majesty, you are as frightening as they say. Ah, uh, Your Highness, so, so good to see you. Aurora is for Aurorans. Go back across the sea and leave us alone. Albion's new ruler is just as bad as the old ruler. Maybe even worse. We cannot afford these taxes. Albion will bleed us dry. You have not helped us, your majesty. Why don't you just give it up and go away? Thank you for keeping the taxes low. You are a wise ruler, your majesty. The people of Aurora thank you. The people seem to accept your rule, my dear. Your Majesty, how delightful. You're very romantic, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, you have so many followers even in the farthest reaches of Albion. My husband, king of the world. The people love you, my sweet. You are amazing. Just amazing. Wow, it's you. Ooh, my knees have gone all wobbly. Oh, look, it's my favorite monarch. Greetings, husband. How are things? Oh, I have missed you so, my little honeyed fig. Welcome home. Ah, like a lost sheep you finally turned up. Where have you been all this time? I was beginning to think you were dead. Hello, my love. That was quite a day, wasn't it? I always knew you would make it. But I still can't really believe we're here. I mean, look at this place. A real castle. I'll need some time to get used to it. I knew you wouldn't kill Logan. 
He has done some terrible things, but he's still your brother. And you shouldn't start your rule with blood on your hands. You are not like him. Logan deserved the harshest punishment, you know. It must have been so difficult. He was your brother. But I understand why you had to do it. All that matters now is that we're together. And that you can make things right. Come on. Let's get some rest, shall we? We could both use some. This feels like the end of a very, very long day. I could sleep for a week. Aren't you tired? You must be. I believe the king should go to bed now. And you have to do what the royal consort tells you. It's the rule. I don't think we'll be hearing from the soldiers of the true king ever again. Time to go home. You deserve a reward, don't you, my dear? Thank you for rescuing me, my darling. Thank you so much. I love you. You are a true hero. Are you sure this is the right way, my love? It doesn't seem right. I'd rather go straight home, if that's all right. Or are you lost? Hey, you. Come here. Let me show you a real fight. Pa! You call yourself a hero? A real hero wouldn't run away. Come here and fight me like a man. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> you can't. Did I hurt your feelings, girl? Are you going to run home and cry now? You think you're the king? You're nothing but a worthless barbarian to me. Did I hurt your feelings, boy? Are you going to run home and cry now?